Hello there and welcome to another video. My name is Riley and today I'm going to be giving you a quick five minute overview of the cryptocurrency known as ICON. Now I want to get straight into it so if you haven't already please hit that like button and that subscribe button if you're not subscribed and let's get straight into it shall we? Okay, so to start off, what is ICON? And ICON is a blockchain platform which allows various blockchains to interact with each other via smart contracts. So it's connectivity between blockchains. So they can allow blockchains to speak to each other, well not literally speak obviously, but communicate with each other uh, digitally and enable cross-chain uh, transactions and things like that. They eventually want to provide a platform where players from financial, security, insurance, healthcare, educational and commercial industries and beyond can coexist and transact over the single network. So what it is, it sounds like when you explain this, it sounds like it's a centralized thing, but it's actually, it's a decentralized service. It's just on the platform um, of ICON, but it's still decentralized. It was founded by the Daily Financial Group, a Korean fintech company valued at $4 billion that also owns a popular Korean exchange known as Coin One, and I'm sure many of you have heard of this. Each community can communicate with each other whilst having their own currency and their own set of rules, even with their own consensus algorithm. And this is really good because it allows people, um, they're not restricted in the blockchains that they can make if they want to be eligible for this platform. They can have all the person um, customizability they want and still participate in this network. So the blockchain ID works via smart contracts and will save time when verifying your identity to do things like get a student discount or bank um, open a bank account. And they're just very simple uh, examples. And I'm sure it can be pushed much further than that. The ICON wallet is able to exchange, transfer, and settle various cryptocurrencies in real time using a decentralized exchange. So that's one of the big things on how it works is using a decentralized exchange. ICX is the cryptocurrency on the platform and it is used as a medium exchange on the platform when you're trading between currencies. So the future of ICON, uh, they have just released their mainnet a couple of weeks ago, so that was a really big thing for them to allow them to start developing on the network. And they've been a big, quite busy in quarter one of 2018. They've only got quite a short roadmap, but as we can see here, they've got the expansion of uh, their pool to allow for most major cryptocurrencies and also expanding their partnerships with blockchain network. And also, as I said before, they're launching their mainnet and they're looking to really just consolidate and start getting some growth on this platform because that's going to really be the thing that determines its success is how much it gets used and how much it gets mass adopted. Also, they have a couple of things coming in 2018 in quarter three, but there's nothing really that significant coming um, just yet on the roadmap, but I'm sure they will update this over time. So the team, they have a really, really good team at um, Icon, and this is just a few people, a few people advising the project, and just to name a few, I thought I'd just give you some samples. We can see here Don Tapscott, if you've never heard of him, he is a really big influential person in the cryptocurrency space. And as we can see, he's, he's been very, very active. He's had many prestigious awards, like for example here, named as the fourth most important business thinker in the world. Um, Jason Best, he's, a really, he's another big name in the industry. Um, he's been also named uh, influential by Forbes and worked for some other big companies. Um, I don't know how to pronounce this, uh, Yisel Cho. She's studied at MIT and worked for some big companies like Facebook and uh, is actually leading the uh, blockchain development team at HSBC. Also for Ismail here, he has worked for other big companies as well and has a lot of experience in the technology space. So now some quick thoughts on Icon, and I think Icon utilizes blockchain in a very creative way to solve some big problems faced by other platforms. Its scalability, accessibility, and interoperability make it, very, make it a very ambitious platform with huge potential for growth. And that's only considering its current use cases. So we're not even taking into account the future use cases as blockchain and as Icon gets developed. So I'm sure the market that they can um, target will just be huge in the future. 
their interoperability alliance that they have with Ion and OneChain, which will be some other currencies that I'll be reviewing uh, very soon, will really benefit them greatly and give them a lot more power and room to move. And if everything goes to plan, Icon could play a huge role in the real world adoption of cryptocurrencies and the integration of blockchain technology into businesses, enterprises and markets. And it's for all these reasons why I give Icon a very strong long term hodl. And I will be picking it up and adding it to my long term altcoin uh, baskets and dollar cost averaging it over the next, well, next few years, gr um, granted things go to plan. So that's Icon in under five minutes. I want to thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked this video or found it helpful, please leave a thumbs up and a comment below on another cryptocurrency you would like to see me overview in under five minutes. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'll catch you next time.